Welcome back guys, uh, this is another video from Shomu's Biology and in this video we will be talking about uh, the gene regulation in uh, prokaryotes. I will be doing two separate videos, one for the gene regulation in prokaryotes, another is for the gene regulation in eu eukaryotes. Now also we will be talking about the differences between the gene regulation in prokaryotes as well as eukaryotes. So to understand that you need to watch both of these videos. So uh, first of all prokaryotic gene regulation is very simple, it's not that much complicated compared with the eukaryotic uh, gene regulation. Prokaryotic gene regulation, uh, to understand prokaryotic gene regulation you need to know some basic feature of the gene structure of prokaryotes. Now the idea for the prokaryotes, the whole idea for the gene regulation is, the idea behind it is that we want to control, we want to control the expression of certain genes. For example, let's say, let's say we have a larger DNA, let's say we have this is the DNA, this is the double stranded DNA and from this DNA we have produced the RNA, let's say this is the RNA, this is the RNA that we produce, the mRNA that we produce. Now this mRNA contains all the different genes in the different regions actually. And this mRNA will be translated into protein products. That's the actual thing. The proteins, that's what we all talk about. Proteins, right? The ultimate thing. So here, gene regulation is a process of regulating the expression of certain genes that are present in DNA that will finally make the protein. For example, let's say protein A is only required when I need to break down lactose. Or let's say when the bacteria needs to break down lactose. So that is the condition. So if there is lactose present and if only the bacteria wants to break the lactose down, then only it will express the protein A, I mean the gene for the protein A. Let's say this is the gene for protein A and then only it will express this protein A. On the other side, when they don't have any lactose present, they will not break, they will not produce this gene A product to break it down because this is the enzyme that will break down lactose. So in that case, the expression of that gene, the expression of that gene, that is the gene A, will be blocked, will be off, right? So the idea behind the gene regulation in prokaryote is simple process called on-off switch. On-off switch. So simply two things can happen, either on or off, of the gene. And another idea in this case of prokaryotic gene arrangement and structure, but you will find a specific regions that are called as promoters, the sections called as promoters. So once we have all those promoter at the earlier stage, so this is the promoter and downstream of that promoter we have other genes. Let's say all the different genes, let's say gene A, gene G, let's say, let's say C, uh, gene Q and so on, many different varieties of genes that are present and as you can see here multiple genes are clustered one after another and all of those genes are expressed by the control or the regulation of one promoter only this is this promoter and usually after the promoter they also have another region called the operator or oocyte here so the promoter operator this is the only one thing and this one promoter controls the expression of multiple genes that are clustered one after another in the downstream of that promoter. That is the structural feature of prokaryotic gene. So the promoter is the control segment, right? And controller elements will interact with the promoter and then the promoter will tell whether this gene sequence is to be transcribed into mRNA or not. And once you produce the mRNA, it will be translated into proteins. So in this case, if this promoter turn off the whole system of gene expression, then the gene expression of all these genes will be halted. And if it turns on, then all the gene expression will start again. And that thing that multiple genes are getting on and off simultaneously due to the regulation of one promoter is called as operon, operon concept. And that's where we come from. So this is an example of operon. And this is the way prokaryotes regulate their gene expression. Let's say there are different types of operon like lactose operon, tryptophan operon, arabinose operon. These are all metabolic kind of operon. There are also other operon like lux, rex, many different varieties of operon that are present there. 
these are for the quorum sensing thing always so the idea here for example one example let's say we all know about the lack of an tryptophan of an albinus of the idea behind this is that let's say in a medium let's say this is a bacteria and in the medium bacteria we always prefer to take glucose as their carbon source but let's say there are no glucose glucose left in the medium only lactose present and to break down lactose this bacteria needs to produce different type of lactose breaking down enzyme so let's say that enzyme is coded by a particular gene let's say the lac gene lac y z a let's say this is how the genes are arranged and they are under the control of one promoter element and then one operator is there so that is how the genes are arranged for the lac operon now the idea here if this lactose are present it provides a signal to this promoter section and this promoter section turn the synthesis of all these mrnas on as a result it will start making all these genes mrna of the, all these genes and then finally it will make the proteins let's say lac y proteins which is an enzyme which helps in breakdown of lactose that's how the whole process work and same thing if there is the presence of glucose along with the lactose then bacteria don't want this lactose to be broken down because they already have the glucose the simplest form so they will take up the glucose and the presence of glucose again signal the promoter to not start transcribing all those lactose breakdown enzyme genes and they will not do that that's how they regulate this process so this is how a prokaryote regulates the gene expression okay so if you like the video don't forget to subscribe hit the like button share this video with your friends in all the social networks thank you